There you go. Washing the windows. <laughs> How good's that? So welcome to Auckland. I'm staying at the Heritage Hotel. It's like a uh, like a condo, a condo hotel. So it's um it's in a hotel, but it's not a hotel room. So let's go in, and I'll show you the hotel. It's just the foyer. Got nice lights there. But let's go upstairs and check out the room. How about that for service? It's pretty good. Get the key card. So let me tell you about these lifts. They were broken last night when I when I arrived. So all three lifts were broken. So I had to go up the stairs, up 11 levels to get up to the apartment. And I met a few guys doing the same, even a few food delivery guys. So that was it's pretty funny. But anyway, here we are, we're at the room now. Okay, so this is the room. We've got the bathroom, shower, toilet. Uh, you've got a little kitchenette here, which is pretty cool. You've got an oven, hot plates, a little bar fridge, and then you've got the bedroom, so it's a good, it's a good bed. It's a good bed, really comfortable. Um, it's a good size room. It's got a little settee or settee, television. Also, you've got a window that looks out onto a courtyard but down below, which is more so just in between the buildings, the adjacent buildings. Yeah, so um, not too bad. Yeah, so today I'm going to look around Auckland, just have a look and see what there is to see get in the ferry terminal um, hopefully get some info on the ferries to go to a few a few of the islands around the place so that'll be a plan and then I'll be able to organize uh, the rest of the week so yeah let's go and look at Auckland Auckland a city of sales let's go so we're just walking down to the local marina on the on the harbor here so let's have a look and see what magnificent boats there are this marina they look like beauties big all right <laughs> wow look at these cruisers this one just coming in look at the size of these these are enormous would you call them boats or ships I know, they're pretty big I'd call them be close to a ship. Nice piece of art there. Ah, it's blown by the wind. Right. Very good. Wow, look at that. That is a beauty. Look at the size of that thing. Wow. Look at that, that's so big, <laughs> that is big. I was waiting for that boat to go out. Yeah, isn't it? The sea breeze. Some nice, nice units just behind me there. Very nice. So this area we're in at the moment is called the viaduct. I don't know what it means, but I'd say it has something to do with the water. A viaduct is water in the old Roman days. So I'd say that's sort of what it implies. A lot of these 
all these boats like this one here the ultimate on water experience cruise New Zealand so you can hire the boats and they can take you out I don't know probably for a couple of days because you can sleep on the boat so that'd be, that'd be a good trip so now we're on the other side of of the marina I'll walk up here and have a look so this section here it intrigues me because it's got its own little like little pontoons jetties here it's like it's part of the hotel but it's also got this this inlet outlet that goes out into the main main marina so I reckon these here these bridges or walkways they move because you've got stop and go lights there so your red light there and you got a red light there so I reckon if you park your boat in here you can get it out in and out going through here that's tricky <laughs> it's very narrow so it wouldn't have, it couldn't be a big boat but still it's pretty good Wow look at this this is enormous so it goes from there way 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 it's about 20 steps to here that's enormous that's an enormous yacht look at the mast on it look how tall the mast is wow <laughs> that's ridiculous I've never seen a yacht that big never So this is the Park Hyatt, the Park Hyatt Hotel. So let's have a look inside. We'll have a look inside and see what it's like. Wow, look at that. That's magnificent. Wood carving. Let's go inside and have a look. Oh, yep. <laughs> Just like all the other park heights I've, I've visited, it's magnificent. Look at the atrium. Sorry. Nice coloured screen. Ah, it's beautiful. What a beautiful hotel. So now we're outside of the hotel. Still in the marina. Still looking out over the boats. And there's the tower. So let's walk up here. Some nice Maori art carvings. They're great. Huh. How good are they? outside the entrance of the hotel beautiful there's a bridge crossing over that's the bridge we saw when that boat went out that little boat went out and it lifted up so we'll have to walk across that get to the other side <laughs> Some little girls playing in the water pretty cold pretty cold all right, let's have a look through here. So we've got, we've got like a shopping mall type thing in here, I think. Or, or actually, I know what this is. This could be the cruise liner place. Cruise liner berth. Let's go and have a look. Is this the New Zealand base, the Emirates team? The Emirates team, New Zealand base. So I don't know what... Emirates have got to do with this. That's open, but it's all open. Hey, what's, what's this area here? What's this? Is it for cruises or? Uh, no, cruises. Well, we haven't had cruises for a few years. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's this for then? This is the America's Cup. Oh, America's Cup. Yeah, all over 
Oh, of course. So when they come here, they well, they base themselves here for the America's Cup. Yeah. Right. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. So that's what it is. So in New Zealand, in Auckland, they have every four years the America's Cup, and it's um, it's a race between um, America's best yachts and overseas yachts. So it's a big, big race, big race. Australia's won it a couple of times. I'm not sure if New Zealand has or not, but uh, yeah, it's um, it's a massive race. But every, I'm pretty sure it's every four years. So this is the base for the America's Cup. Well, there you go. Interesting. So this is coming up to a really modern building. It's got like louvers on the front of the building there. Oh, this is pretty cool. It's got this like smokestacks of, a, of an old ship. Smokestacks everywhere. But um, yeah, you've got a lot of eateries along here. So, very nice. So be popular during the night time. It's got the fires there going. Some aren't. There's a couple there. Oh, that wind. That wind is so strong. <laughs> Almost blew me off my feet. This place here is supposed to have the best fish and chips on the wharf. That's what I reckon. There you go. It's in writing, so it must be right. Must be true. Best fishing ships on the wharf. The Wynyard Pavilion. It's official supporters bar of the Emirates Team New Zealand for the America's Cup. There you go. There's a hungry seagull waiting to try and scavenge some food. Go on, go and get those chips over there. Off he goes. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to cross over this bridge and um, get back to the hotel because there's a storm coming. <laughs> Looks like it's coming pretty fast too. So let's get back where we, aren't we? we won't get wet. Looks like a racing yacht there. All right, let's cross over. traffic lights which, which tell you when the bridge is going to come up or not so, so it's not flashing or anything so that's good so we're right to cross over There's a big yacht. Look at that. <laughs> KZ1. What a beauty. Okay, so we're back at the ferries. So what I might do is I might walk up. Oh, the rain's coming now. <laughs> um, yeah, no back to the hotel. It's going to pour soon. Try and go across here. Walk through here. Try and get some cover. It's an underground a delivery area. Oh, the wind's picked up too. It's like a wind tunnel in here. Looking at the sky, I can see blue skies now. So I think that wind has blown the rain away. Maybe. Well, I think we're right. I think the clouds have been blown over over where I'm walking towards. So if I don't go too far, I won't hit the rain. So that's good. 
again, it's got the timer, so you know how much time you've got until the lights turn, so. Plenty of time. So this here is Queen Street. So this is the main shopping area of, of Auckland. So see most of the high-end shops like Swarovski, Dior Prada, Bulgari. Yeah, they're all here. All here to get your money. So many scooters too. Scooters and bikes to rent. Lime. I think lime's everywhere. Another one. Yeah, so what they do is just drop them off and someone else picks it up. There's a wide you breaks and my name's hard still in the letter stand straight. Little animals and those push up leaders. Tight dresses and rhinestone rings, drinking up the bands. 